Hi, uh, my name's Richard, um, and I'm going to be talking to you about some uh, homeowner tips, how to keep your house and your flat and your accommodation secure. Okay, so what you and I have in common is the fact that we have, all have locks on our house. And there's all different types of locks um, for all different types of um, houses and for all different, different types of doors. Uh, but generally, um, we want to make sure our, our houses and our flats are secure. So we should really be thinking about choosing a good security lock. There's all different brands and there's all different levels of security. Um, so I'm going to show you this lock here. This lock here is an era, era lock. Okay. What we call a night latch. Now, a night latch basically is, is what you what you have here. Okay, this is a night latch. But this is a different type of lock where it has an anti-slip mechanism, which actually makes this night latch a locking door. So the main thing is once this part of the lock is fitted correctly, once this is depressed, you cannot open the door from the outside, which is a nightmare for burglars because normally they'll try and get through the shut of the door and they'll push that latch back and open the door but this this lock here doesn't allow that to happen if it's fitted correctly if it's not fitted correctly then this doesn't work and then they can gain access this way. so yeah this is a this is a good lock um it's not british standard even though it's a good lock it's still not british standard british standard one will be a little bit more bigger and it'll be harder to kick off. Um, so that is the lock now. So saying that there is pros and cons on on what you buy. So this person's bought a good lock, but what they've forgotten is this door can easily be opened from the letterbox. So if I was a burglar, I'd basically come through that letterbox, open that latch, and I'm in. So your anti-slip really doesn't make no sense. 